27 Beauceron Facts Every Owner Should Know Number 1. The Beauceron, also known as the Berger de Boche or the Basque Rogue, is a large sheepdog that's both faithful and gentle. Males typically stand 25.5 to 27.5 inches tall, while females are a bit smaller at 24 to 26.5 inches. These dogs can weigh anywhere from 70 to 110 pounds. Number 2. A formidable dog with an athletic and unwavering appearance. The Beauceron has a gaze that is frank, alert, and confident. Their dark brown oval-shaped eyes and high-set ears, which may be kept cropped or natural, further accentuate their confident look, imparting a hint of intelligence and alertness to the dog. Number 3. The breed's tail is robust at the base, extending at least to the hock and forming a slight J-shape without swaying to the right or left. During movement, the tail can be carried higher, serving as an extension of the top line. However, a Beauceron with a dock tail or one carried over the back may be disqualified from confirmation shows. Number 4. These dogs have a double coat that provides insulation in various weather conditions. The outer coat is coarse, dense, and lice close to the body, being short and smooth on the head, ears, and lower legs. There is slightly longer hair around the neck, with light fringing on the tail and back of the thighs. The undercoat, in a mouse gray color, is short, fine, dense, and downy, remaining hidden beneath the outer coat. Number 5. The Beauceron's coloring is well balanced, often seen in a black and scroll red tuxedo pattern. In black and tan dogs, tan markings should be present in two dots above the eyes, on the sides of the muzzle, fading off to the cheeks but not reaching the underside of the ears. Tan markings are also found on the throat, under the tail, and on the legs and chest. However, Beauceron's can also come in shades of gray black with tan and even harlequin. While harlequin coats should have more black than gray and should not include any white. Number 6. While many breeds may have or lack the claws, a distinctive trait of the Beauceron is the presence of double the claws. To meet show standards, a Beauceron must have well-separated thumbs with nails on each rear leg. Anything less leads to disqualification from dog shows. The Beauceron's double the claws are connected by bone, and some dogs can even flex each one individually. Number 7. The presence of double the claws on the hind leg suggests that the Beauceron shares common ancestry with the long-haired Briard sheepdog. However, it is frequently mistaken for a mixed breed, with some speculating a heritage of Rottweiler and German Shepherd parentage. Number 8. As per the AKC breed standard, a Beauceron can be disqualified from confirmation shows for having a height outside of maximum or minimum limits, a split nose, nose colors other than black, an overshot or undershot bite, yellow eyes, shaggy coats, or for having any color other than black and tan or harlequin. A complete absence of markings on the coat can also lead to disqualifications. Number 9. A highly intelligent dog with excellent people-pleasing skills, the Beauceron effortlessly picks up new tricks and skills. They are well suited to competitive dog activities like obedience, rally, agility, herding, and scent work due to their ability to learn a variety of skills. However, their high intelligence and herding heritage can sometimes lead to independent thinking and stubbornness as they may prefer to do things their own way. Number 10. Bred primarily for herding cattle and sheep, the Berger de Beauce is an active dog that thrives on given tasks and activities to engage in. A Beauceron needs to be kept happy with plenty of physical and mental stimulation, and an active Beauceron can quickly become unhappy and may resort to destructive behaviors such as excessive barking, digging, and chewing if not adequately stimulated. Number 11. The breed is endowed with a keen and watchful eye, enabling them to detect and follow quick movements, keeping them consistently alert. They excel in signaling anything that requires attention, and if they perceive something or someone as part of their herd, they display remarkable courage in protecting their herd members. This quality makes the Beauceron an excellent watchdog and an even more formidable guard dog. Number 12. The Beauceron is highly affectionate towards their loved ones, earning them the nickname Velcro Dogs. They enjoy staying close to their families, following them everywhere, even from the living room to the bathroom. Due to their strong attachment, leaving them alone for extended periods is not recommended, as it can lead to severe cases of separation anxiety. Number 13. As naturally curious dogs, Beaucerons love exploring their surroundings and are known for their escapades. These dogs, with their love for outdoor activities, may attempt to escape if left unsupervised in an open area. To prevent any issues, it's essential to have a securely fenced yard to ensure they can't escape by digging under or jumping over the fence. Number 14. Generally robust and healthy, the Beauceron has an average life expectancy of 10 to 12 years. With proper care, affection, and a good quality of life, many individuals can live even longer and more fulfilling lives. Number 15. Although typically hardy, the Berger de Beauce, like any other dog, can be susceptible to a few health issues. Owners should be vigilant of conditions such as hip and elbow dysplasia, dilated cardiomyopathy, hypothyroidism, allergies, cataracts, and progressive retinal atrophy. 
number 16. Large dogs with deep chests, such as the Beauceron, are susceptible to a life-threatening issue called gastric dilatation volvulus, or bloat. In this condition, the dog's stomach fills up with air and twists painfully, cutting off the blood supply. If not properly treated, it can lead to death of the dog in just a matter of hours. Number 17. Beauceron puppies may also be susceptible to osteochondritis desiccans, an abnormality typically observed in rapidly growing large dogs, leading to bone development issues. This genetic condition can result in lameness in joints such as the shoulder, elbow, and knees, with the shoulder and elbow being more commonly affected in most cases. Number 18. A French herding breed originating in the Beauce region of northern France, the Beauceron has a long history as a sheep herder and working companion exclusively developed in France. It is a rare breed outside of France and is the largest and one of the oldest French breeds, with mentions in historical documents dating as far back as the 1500s. Number 19. Originally developed as a multi-purpose dog by the early 1800s, the Beauceron gained popularity for herding cattle and sheep across the plains of La Beauce, often working alongside their cousin breed, the Briard. Beaucerons made their first recognized public appearance as an established breed in 1863 at the Universal Exposition in Paris. Number 20. With increasing popularity and widespread breeding, the Beauceron was officially recognized by the Société Centrale Canine in 1893 as the Berger de Beauce, and in 1922, the breed club Club des Amis du Beauceron was founded. Number 21. Over time, the Berger de Beauce caught the attention of the dog-loving French public, including the renowned French author and woman of letters, Sidonie Gabrielle Colette, simply known as Colette. Colette wrote that her Beauceron was one of those rare companions who remained silent at the right time, respected her work and her sleep, howled for her tears, and closed her eyes with a bitter discretion in the face of anything. Number 22. Beaucerons were even enlisted by the French army during the World Wars, serving prominently as messengers due to their adeptness in following commands. They played crucial roles in mine detection and tracking. Today, these canines continue to be valued for their skills and are employed as police dogs and in various search and rescue operations. Number 23. The breed remained virtually unknown outside of France until the Second World War. In the 1960s, the French Ministry of Agriculture requested the Société Centrale Canine to develop a confirmation examination to safeguard the breed's qualities. There was a concern that with modernization, the breed could face extinction or dilution. Number 24. Recorded in the AKC's Foundation Stock Service since 1998, the Beauceron received official recognition at a later date. The breed was fully inducted into the American Kennel Club's herding group in 2007 and made its first appearance at the Westminster Kennel Club Dog Show in 2008. Number 25. A fairly rare breed, the Beauceron has been gradually gaining popularity in the United States thanks to some dedicated followers and breeders. According to the AKC's list of the most popular dog breeds in America in 2022, based on nationwide registrations, the Beauceron ranked 111th out of a total of 199 registered dog breeds. Number 26. The Beauceron has its share of heroic tales, one notable example being Kara. This exceptional Beauceron played a crucial role in the search and rescue operations at the World Trade Center tragedy in 2001, equipped with a special camera around her neck, allowing humans to see into crevices that only dogs could reach. Kara's commendable efforts earned her recognition and awards at prestigious events like the AKC Classic and the Westminster Kennel Club Dog Show in 2001 and 2002. Number 27. Despite being relatively rare, the Beauceron has made notable appearances in various films, including the James Bond movie Moonraker, the 1990 Luke Besson film Nikita, and Martin Scorsese's Gangs of New York. The 2009 movie Hotel for Dogs, starring Emma Roberts, also featured a Beauceron named Henry. Alright guys, now which of these Beauceron facts surprised you the most? Please let us know in the comments below. Thanks for watching.